All right, hello everyone and peace of Christ to all of you. Uh, please a reminder before we start, in case I, you know, you start having this uh, cycle in your screen, which means my internet is not good, just refresh your page, wait, don't leave, I have bad internet, and we are trying to fix that issue. Uh, until now, they could not really uh, fix it. So, in case, you know, like now I check, it sounds good, but sometimes it goes red and go green. Red mean the internet going down. Green mean we are good. So, uh, <clears throat> we have many topics actually to talk about today. And many of you want to talk about uh, Hatun. I saw a video of David Wood. But, I, you know, let me start with my favorite hobby. Then we will go there. This is Sabil Ahmed. Hey, Sabil Ahmed, the guy who said Christian Prince, I did not debate him, Christian Prince. He made a big, look, like, Christian brother, this is not my voice, brother. You know, Sabil Ahmed, he have a video titled, uh, A Hate Preacher, Patient Muslim with Hate Preacher. Islam is 10x better than Christianity. <laughs> you know, you do not need 10 minutes or 10 hours to get this guy down in the floor with his lies. From the first two seconds, he'd start lying. I mean, you cannot find one decent Abdul. Is my voice coming good? Is my voice coming good? Because I see it red now. Do you hear me, guys? I hope so. <coughs> so in this video here, Sabil Ahmad, he came to a Christian. This Christian, obviously, he's like a, he's a, fa a fighter. <laughs> and here you notice the difference between Muslims and Muslims. The Muslims, they go after Hatun because she is a woman, she is a small, she have nobody around to protect her, so they slap her, right? Mm. Who wanna go and slap that guy? Look how Sabil, he act like a cat in the front of this Christian. Watch. And look, this Muslim woman, she is not wearing hijab. And she is telling people, Islam is 10 times better than Christianity. And she's not wearing hijab herself. <laughs> and Sabil, he is not saying to her, oh, what's wrong with you? You cannot say Islam is better. If Islam is better, so why are you not following Islam? This Muslim woman, she is telling the guy, Islam is 10 times better. But she is not following Islam. She don't want to wear hijab. <laughs> And what is that supposed to mean to me? I'm your brother in uh, You're not my brother. I'm your brother in humanity. You're not my brother. You're, are, you, are you a Muslim? I'm a Muslim. How old was Aisha when your prophet married her? Uh, around the same age that me. Look, hardly the voice of Sabil is coming now. Suddenly, you know, in the front of Hatun, they want to scream. Suddenly now, <laughs> okay. So how old Aisha when she get married to Muhammad? This is what Sabil want to say. Where does it say Mary had an age? Uh, no. Well he said the Aisha age is the same as Mary. <laughs> Where? In Catholic Exopolidia. You know, may Allah explode you. You coward liar, son of Muta. Even if we go to the website you are talking about, they will show the following. Coward. Like your prophet. Liars like your prophet, scam, like your prophet. This is in the Catholic Exopolidia. It says that she was in the age of Aisha, which means she was six years old. <laughs> Unbelievable. You are so cute. You are so cute and so coward. And you are sneaky like a snake and you have no dignity. You don't. Because if you have a dignity, if you are a proud Muslim, you will not lie to defend your prophet. But because you are ashamed, so you made now Aisha age 13, 14, 15 years old. And by the way, whatever they say in the uh, Exorlobedia, there's no, there's no source of this. Nowhere in the Bible it says where. But just to show you how stupid you are, you either don't you Muslim believe that Mary, she was a virgin when she gave birth to Jesus? 
if she's a child, she will not be able to give birth. <laughs> she is the same as as Maryam. Where? In the Catholic Encyclopedia. <laughs> uh, potato. Potato and coward. So this is the first slide. This is in the first 23 seconds. The first 10 seconds, 15 seconds, he was walking. The second he start talking, the same second he start lying. This is the age of Aisha. Six years old. <clears throat> Somebody saying Muslims don't think. No, my friend, they think. They think. Because they think, they assume that you are an idiot and you are stupid. You do not know. No, they think very well. Don't, don't you know? Do you think really this guy, he do not know what was really the age of Aisha? Do you think really he don't? Again, if we lose connection, if you start seeing the circle of death, you know, in your screen, don't go. Just have patience. We will refresh it and we will be back. My, my internet go up and down. My internet is the same as Allah. He's a yo-yo. You know the yo-yo? Allah is a yo-yo. Some the hadith says so, the hadith says so. Allah he comes down every third part of the night, yo-yo. So the hadith in the front of us says Aisha is saying that she was six years old. Can you show us where in the Exopedia it says Mary, Mary she was six years old? Secondly, you idiot, Mary she gave birth and she was a virgin, which means that there's not no marriage there. What those people are talking about? Coward. And then he starts saying, you see, they start playing the snakes. Islam is against hate. You know, did you see today they are talking about Islam is against hate? The Prince of Qatar says Islam is against hate. Erdogan says Islam is against hate. All of them are against hate. Are you against the Quran? Are you against the Quran? Because if you are against hate, you're coward. Then you should be against the Quran. The Quran says Allah will spread hate and enmity into the judgment day. Between who? The Christians specifically. We are against hate. Those brother, brother, who they are making cartoon of the Prophet, brother, they are spreading hate. Brother, Islam is against hate, brother. And yeah, you know, true. Islam is against hate. To the point Allah, he have a career. If we open the resume of Allah, we will find him saying, and from those who say we are Christians, we receive their pledge, but they neglected some of what they were reminded. So we provoked enmity and hatred among them until the day of resurrection. So you coward liars, you are against hate. So are you against Allah? Allah, he said, I am going to provoke hate. I am going to send hate I'm going to make them hate monger, which is false, you know. I mean, he is, yes, he make them, he make people hate mongers, yes. But you don't make us hate monger. You cannot. Otherwise, then we will hate the Muslims and we don't hate them. So you fail Allah. Again, I see my, my connection going red. Guys, just if you, if you lose the connection, don't just leave, please. Just refresh your page. You see, I'm not going live because of the stupid connection. So, we're against hate, brother. <laughs> Erdogan. Oh, eh, you know, our Erdogan, the Prince of Qatar, the King of Morocco, the King of Jordan. I mean, I, I want to play the, those, those, uh, those kings. They, for me, they have a name. They are dogs. And they have only one anthem fit with them. I'm talking about the kings. The only anthem play with them or the song is Who Let the Dogs Out? Who? Who? Suddenly everybody is against hate. <laughs> we are against hate. <laughs> are you? Then go and eat this verse in the Quran, the same as the goat ate the chapter of ten times breastfeeding, which Aisha she mentioned it, and Aisha she practiced it. Or get that verse back because I'm hungry. Now we go back to Sabil Ali. Sabil Ahmed, sorry. Oh boy. <clears throat> we will talk. We will talk about Hatun. Just read, guys. Why you are in a rush? You're not my brother. I'm your brother in humanity. You're not my brother. You're, are, you, are you a Muslim? He is saying to the guy, You are my brother in humanity. Is that Islamic? Is that Islamic? 
absolutely false you are a big fraud look how many fingers I left in your bum before even we started according to Islam <clears throat> no Muslim can take non Muslims as a brother even if they are from their own family chapter 58 verse number 22 you will not find people who believe in Allah and the last day loving those who oppose Allah and his messenger even if they were their parents and their children and their sibling and their close relatives and 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 so what this guy is saying you are my brother do you see the cowards you are my brother we are brothers in humanity <laughs> what is it the Quran says Christians and Jews are filthy they are pigs and they are monkeys how we are brothers since when isn't it the Quran says only believers are brothers coward one of the signs of liars or let's say following a cult is to be ashamed to say what your cult believe you know what I mean it's a good sign by the way because if those people are not ashamed why they are lying why they are not proud about what the Quran say why he didn't say is true we are not brothers that's what Islam teach yes true Quran says only Muslims are brothers to each other And the hadith come from that. The second you see them trying to hide, and which is all what Muslims do, that's mean they are ashamed of their... You see, the only Muslim I see who is a true Muslim honest is ISIS. And why ISIS will be brave to say? Because now he is between the terrorists and he is out of your hands. So he will say it as it is. Those potatoes, they live here, they cannot say the truth. Ah, we are brothers. Yeah, okay, what is next? I mean, how many lies I have to get you busted before I start, man? Give me one more lie and that's it for today. Then we will talk about other topic. How old was Aisha when your prophet married her? Uh, around the same age that Mary was. Where does it say Mary had an age? <laughs> no, well, we're not... First, the cat, they didn't say that, you're a liar. <laughs> People right now as you and I are talking. So don't tell me you're Islam, friends. Islam is perfect just because... We are friends. He told him we are friends. Hold on, I missed that. Hold on. Don't tell me we are friends. Hold on. You're about as wacko as it gets. So I came here and we came here just to look at our friends. What we can be friends, guys. We can be friends. I mean, every second, every word he said, this idiot liar, he is lying. How we can be friends? Let us see. I'm going to go right now to the Quran and see if we can be really friends or this guy is a fraud like as a prophet. What do you think? Who think that we can really be friends according to Islam? No, we cannot. Chapter 5, verse 51. Take not Christians and Jews. And if you don't like a, a certain translation, choose any, any stupid translation you like. All of them, they are liars. I never saw a one single Muslim translation is accurate and actually this is what I would do when you know like I get my time I will start transla you know, finishing the, the translation for the Quran let us see translation translation brother we are brothers we are brothers we are friends we are friends yeah obviously chapter 50 chapter 45 verse number 51 I kept like I keep having the, the, the I did not even eat. Oh, who you believe? Take not the Jews and the Christians for your friends and protectors. How come we did not lose internet until now? That's that's a miracle. What's happening? Okay. Uh, take not. Oh, who you believe? Take not the Jews and the Christians as a friends. But this guy, he was saying the guy. No, we can be friends. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
da. Was ist so gut, ne? Ja. Yeah. That's so good. That's so beautiful. Do you see how how much ashamed they are of their teaching? He didn't say yes, you are right, we cannot be friends. Why he is hiding? Because he is playing taqiyya, he is a coward. This is a clear indication for anyone who is hearing this for the first time that Islam is from the devil. Otherwise, why they are lying to us about their belief? Why somebody is ashamed of his belief? Why you, you don't say, okay, yes, Islam teaches us we cannot be friends. The Quran says so. I mean, which one we will believe now? Sabil, he the sneaky, or Muhammad, the freaky? Huh? Which one we will believe? You tell me, Muslims, which one you should follow? I'm, I will go with you. If Sabil became your prophet and you have a new religion, it's called Sabil Ahmed religion, Ahmadiyya. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy okay let us finish with this guy obviously he's a donkey uh you know what guys i'm going to stop this broadcast give me just 10 minutes i will make some coffee i will make a broadcast so people they can download this topic alone and then we will talk about uh Hatun and the video of david wood is that okay as long as the internet is working fine, so we will make them two videos. Because until now, I did not lose the connection, which is a miracle. That's so good to be true. <clears throat> we, we will make another uh, video. Uh, I will call it FBI in my door. Because uh, I saw a video of uh, uh, David. He have uh, such a video. All right. Just give me 10 minutes, I will make some tea or coffee. And uh, which which one, tea or coffee? Is tea as halal? <laughs> the prophet never drink tea. He drink camel urine. <laughs> Why you Muslim don't follow the steps of the prophet? And now you drink, I mean, Pepsi Cola. Because, boycott, boycott, boycott. I mean, this boycott is something. I used to say, be, be caught. It's boycott, Christian, it's boycott. So it's not a girl caught. It's a boycott. Oh, okay. English is really weird. Anyway. <laughs> Be, you know, actually, you know, we will talk about that. Just let us go. Let us go. Let us make some coffee and then we'll be back. All right. Uh, <clears throat> before, let me say bye bye before my internet go off. I think my internet went off for a second or something. I'm not sure. Anyway, guys. We will be back in uh, uh, 10 minutes, 15 minutes, 10 minutes, 10 minutes. Just give me 10 minutes. I will make the topic and we'll be back. All right. Thank you. And God bless you. Take care.